Hey guys, happy Tuesday. Thanks for watching our videos. Um, yesterday was a high volume, high cardio day. Uh, today is gonna be a couple different weightlifting pieces. Again, this is a deload week before we start a new training cycle, um, heading into the open starting in the new year. So, five minute cardio warm up. Grab a bike, grab a rower, uh, warm up those legs and hips. Uh, recommend the rower today since we're doing some deadlifting, start working that hinging pattern at the hip. Uh, so, five minute cardio. Then we got a couple rounds. Grab a dumbbell. We're gonna go single leg Romanian deadlifts. Hold the uh, dumbbell in the opposite hand from the leg you're balanced on. Hinge at the hip. Lower the dumbbell to about shin height or ankle height. Keep that back straight and fight that rotational uh, pull as you descend. Slight bend in the knee, big bend in the hip. 10 on each side. Then we have squat jumps. So feel free to warm up with just some singles, maybe on round two, go into the reactive squat jump. Uh, what else do we have? Oh, muscle cleans. So we're going between the legs, or sorry, muscle clean. So we're just gonna get a single extension of the hips and knees and press. So it's a muscle clean, we're not gonna re-bend the legs underneath. Okay, 10 on each side. And then finally, banded face pulls. Hang a band from a pull-up bar, light tension. We're gonna keep the uh, knuckles up, and then we're gonna pull the elbows out to the side, pulling right about forehead to eye level. Okay, we shouldn't be pulling down or up here. Elbows go out, band right in front of the eyes. Okay, squeeze the upper back as you pull. So go through that as your warm up. Then we have part one, Olympic weightlifting. Okay, for our weightlifting today, we're going high hang snatch. For our weightlifting today, we're going 10 minutes. Every minute we're performing a triple rep or three rep high hang power snatch. So get a wide grip on the bar, should be resting in the hip crease with that slight dip of the hips and knees, arms straight. Do a slight hinge forward. For the high hang, like to stay about upper or uh, middle thigh up to the hip. So don't go down to the knees on this one. Hinge down a little bit, keep the bar pulled back. Bring the bar to the hips, extend, and punch under the bar. Okay, so we're going 10 minutes, every minute on the minute, doing three reps. That's gonna add up to 30 reps. It's a lot of volume, so start out light and build over those 10 sets. Our second piece for today, for the, the day, is also gonna be strength work. We're going five sets, building in weight. We're going five deadlift, five tempo ring dips. For the deadlift, work around the 60 to 80% of one rep max range. We're not trying to max out this week, um, but make it heavy enough so you have to work to keep good positions, but not heavy enough where you have any uh, technique degradation. Hands right by the hips. Push the hips and knees back into that hinge position. Keep your back straight as you grab the bar. Pull the tension out of the bar and lift. Okay, five reps there. Again, not building to a max. And then we're moving into five tempo ring dips. The tempo is three second descent, three second pause at the bottom. At the bottom, I'm trying to have my shoulders below my elbows. Keep the rings tucked in by your sides. Fast on the way up. One second lockout at extension. Three down, three at the bottom, fast up, one second hold. We're doing five reps. They don't have to be unbroken, but try to keep them uh, as, as few sets as possible. So let's see how this goes. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right, so super challenging. Modifications. 
You can always do these with a band or sub them out for ring push-ups. Lower these about six inches off the ground. We're using the uh, rapid rings here, so really helpful for stuff like this. So same idea, same tempo. One, two, three. One, two, three. Fast, hold, and go into your next one. Assuming a lot of people don't have rings available, you can always substitute either push-ups or like hands elevated push-ups. Either stack some plates, allows you to go deeper into that push-up, or have your hands on dumbbells so your chest can go below hand level. You can float your chest just off the floor at the bottom of this rep. One, two, three. One, two, three. Fast, okay? So that's gonna be a modification for today. Um, if you don't have access to a barbell for deadlifts, uh, feel free to use a kettlebell or dumbbells. Go to a heavy triple if you have access to heavy dumbbells or just increase the volume. Maybe go five sets of 10, five sets of 15 uh, for the strength portion. Thanks for watching guys. See y'all later.